All right, I am especially excited about this. I am uh, uh, here with Matai. Matai uh, is from Slovenia, which is right next to Italy. Yeah. Okay, great. Matai is 25, and he, uh, he's, he's now an NHB -er, uh and he actually wound up, uh, uh, he, he's been with me for a while, so for his whole internet marketing career, uh, all of two years. Uh, he joined, uh, actually, uh, a previous product that I had, uh, sort of a beginner SEO course that I had. It's the same one that, that Greg uh, first joined forces with me on. And he, he got a hold of the idea of launch shacking there. He's really gone nuts with it. And uh, it was overall, uh, it, we've got a, a number of examples for you, live examples and, and tons of documentation. It's really incredible what you've done, Matai. Uh, you said in the email you sent me, that you did uh, five, five figures last year, and, and this year you're on track for six figures. Is that correct? Uh, no, it was five figures two years ago, uh -huh. and la last year was uh, kind of six figure mark. We kind of broke six figure mark. Yeah. That's that's incredible. In, in 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 total sales or even in profit? Uh, profit, yeah. Oh, that's amazing! Wow, that's that's nuts. What's that like being? I just out of curiosity, I'm I'm so happy for you. Being in Slovenia is that is that big money? Uh, yeah, it is actually. Um, kind of average salary here is uh, one thousand euros. Yeah. That is. Uh, let me pull it out. It's uh, one thousand. It's uh, thirteen hundred dollars. Thirteen hundred. Uh, is the average salary, and, and so yeah, obviously right. uh, you're making many times that. That's that's uh, that's awesome. You, your your parents must be happy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, I kind of drop out drop out college, right? Yeah. Uh, to kind of do my own thing with uh, with uh, field marketing and software and SEO. That, that makes me really proud. I I, I love uh, you know killing a day job is one thing, but if I can get you like before you even get to that stage, that makes me like twice as proud. If I keep you from going through through school or, or anything like that, it's like twice as good for me. Yeah, so, yeah. so you've actually had the opportunity, uh, we, we were talking about this earlier, and we'll, we'll get into specific details of uh, the, the actual sites that uh, you've worked on and, and some, some smart techniques that you're using with your launch shacking, uh, which is a great way to get started with affiliate marketing. You actually built quite a list at this point. You have a 3,200 uh, 3, person list? Yeah, yeah, something around, something around that, yeah. And that, that's really, uh, that, that cash on demand and the opportunity to like really help people it uh, probably feels pretty good. Yeah, th definitely. When um, I'm actually not building much in relationship with the list, um, I, I know I supposed to. I was supposed to do it, but uh, I kind of, I kind of have it for my promotions. So uh, sure. Yeah. Well, you'll get better and better at it, uh, which is great. You're on the, <laughs> you're on the OMG list now. You'll see how I do it. You can do it the, uh, do it the same way. I know you'll be. Uh, I'm actually excited. You're you're actually uh, starting to come out with your own products as well. So uh, so that so that'll be good uh, good timing. You actually got to speak at uh, at Yonix Underground event. Yeah. Was, that was cool. All, all the way back in the day, I actually helped Yonix uh, a little bit behind the scenes planning the very first Underground. What was that like for you to kind of get to to speak in front of a bunch of people in America and uh, you know a bunch of your peers? Is that uh, pretty pretty exciting? Yeah, it was pretty exciting, especially uh, a little bit frightening because uh, obviously English is, is not my first language. So, <laughs> but uh, I actually got on stage because I I, uh, I uh, introduced what I was doing with affiliate marketing, exactly with uh, launch jacking, right? How was I supposed to rank for uh, all these big guru launches uh, and how I did it without any list and just SEO traffic. So uh, uh, apparently Yannick and uh, AJ um, thought this would be a good material for the audience, and I got seven minutes and uh, kind of explained everything what we are doing in our business. That, that's great, we, and, we, and we have a lot more here. Uh, yeah, uh, so, so that's terrific. I've, I've actually uh, helped Yannick uh, line up a few different people for his, uh, his event, but that, that's a really great one. Well, we're, right now, let, let's start uh, with, so the concept of launch jacking is uh, we're going to rank for uh, an, either an upcoming or current product. It's a little bit easier to rank for because it's not an established search term, and there's a lot of excitement behind it. And this is really cool that you're able to do this from Slo Slovenia. It's not your first English is not your first language, 
Um, yep. And you've been able to do this again and again. Where are you finding out about most of your launches? Are you mostly just using JV Notify Pro? Or at this point, you're on a bunch of different lists? Uh, yeah, uh, J JV Notify Pro is the best. But uh, eventually, you wanted to be on the gurus list because uh, before it's actually announced on JV Notifies Pro, uh, there is an email sent out from the gurus that are actually announcing the, the launch coming up. Yeah, it's, a, it's an important tip. Uh, something I try to do inside of Endgame is I really try to keep people up to date, and, and I'm uh, putting together a launch tracking calendar now, which will be helpful. So. Right now, this I've searched up Ezra Firestone Brown Box. We're going to open up your. This is your site here. This ranked number one, Ezra Firestone Brown Box Formula dot com. Yeah. And so what I'm seeing here is we've got this video here, um, and then you've got video three buyer research. Um, so, all right. So these are basically Ezra's. You're just taking his videos and sticking them on your website. Um, and so how, what's your general methodology for doing a review? Like how, how are you doing this? I guess you're reviewing the actual marketing of it. What, what's, what's your general game plan with your websites? Um, when, uh, we start promoting, right. And ranking the website when the pre-launch is on so that we can get, uh, we can get visitors when the, the pre-launch material, pre-launch videos are, uh, 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 online, mm -hmm. so with with each pre-launch video, each pre-launch content, we put up. Uh, uh, we actually just drive people back to the to the main page, so it's just an affiliate link um, that goes back to the uh, pre-launch content. And when the uh, usually when the when the launch day comes. We uh, create a bonus for the people who come to our website. Hey, uh, what kind of bonuses do you like to offer? Um, if uh, we get uh, large commissions, we offer iPads mm -hmm. because I've, iPads tend to work the best for launch checking. Um, we also do uh, coaching, uh, WordPress uh, installation and setup, and uh, SEO actually. We some SEO for the for the guys for the customers who, who uh, buy from our from our, from our links. Great, so so great traditional yeah. launch tech methods, and it re really shows that that, that that works so well. And now you, you revealed to me a, a really neat idea. There's always the question: if you're going to build a number of different sites, then what do you do with the sites when you're done with them? This is a new lesson you, that you taught me. You're actually using yeah. them as a blog network. So if yeah. we go to one of your older launches, I'm going to, can, oh, by the way, how did this uh, launch track go for you? How much money did you make off of it? Uh, the brown box formula? Yeah. Uh, I think we made uh, three or four, four thousand dollars, awesome. something like that. It, it wasn't the most successful, but uh, pretty good. Yeah, you, you said that with the authority formula, uh, uh, Ryan Dice's authority for, formula, you made even more. Yeah, I think about 10. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Okay, so this is Kindle Cash Flow, and if we scroll down towards the bottom, we'll see what a, a number of links. This is the same kind of. This is great. This is Kindle Cash Flow Two dot net. Yeah. And there's a lot of con so I see what you have is th th these are basically articles that you're writing, and then partner with Tom Review, for example, as a backlink here, and so th that that's gonna. Be something for a product called, I guess, partner with Tom. Yeah. Um, all right, great. It's great. That's really, really cool. And obviously, those are relevant. Um, you're getting great relevancy there with, with your links because, of course, they're about internet marketing, the general topic, and uh, you know they're fresh and so forth. And then you're firing new links, so you, you just it's a, a great methodology there. Yeah. Um, so basically, the after the launch is over, right? Uh, th these sites are basically useless because they're not getting any traffic. Um, so what we do is we uh, uh, we uh, we actually start posting blog posts uh, to the bottom with backlinks to our new sites that we use for launch checking. It's so cool. So uh, for the link juice, right? Mm -hmm. what, something that uh, Rick Rivera used to do is he he actually used to take his old sites and post the new launches on them. Uh, as well, yeah. as, uh, something to keep in mind, uh, because sometimes they are getting some amount of 
residual traffic from Warrior Forum or something like that. You know, people, you know, hear about an old launch or whatever, especially the uh, um, the, the more popular ones. Let's look. You, you've really uh, generously, and, and th again, this is so cool. You know, one one of the things that we like to say is that we found with OMG and NHB that uh, NHBers and OMGers are, are not just uh, not just grateful. Um, but they're also extremely generous, and you've already really given us an incredible amount of uh, real-world useful advice. Um, what you've also got here, and this is very motivating for me, um, you've provided me with 65 screen captures uh, of launches that you've been successful on. Uh, I'm looking, for, this is an affiliate ledger for Matai Bester. Uh, is it Bester or Beaster? Be Bester, right? Uh, Bester, yes. Yeah, Bester. That's, uh, uh, sorry about that. And uh, this one's uh, 4,200, uh, uh, 42, uh, 4,242 dollars uh, from. This is all the way back from uh, uh, 2011. So there's yeah, a, this one is all yeah a, t a ton of different ones. I'm going to kind of flip through these uh, as we go along. Obviously, you can't see what's on my screen. One of the things that, that people don't realize is that sometime launches hit well. Sometimes you rank particularly well. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes the launch isn't that great. Sometimes it is a good launch, and you rank well, and you still don't make a lot of money. Um, uh, I think that one of the uh, great things to see here is that, I mean, for you, you're just, it's a, a bit of a numbers game for you. You're not, like, emotionally attached to any, in the, uh, in any given launch. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Uh, it's true what you said, because sometimes the launch is... Uh, it's good. Sometimes it's not. You never really, really know, right? Even if when it uh, when it comes to big gurus when they launch their products, you never really know if it's gonna be a successful launch or not. So even e e either way, right? You have a website, you put it up, and even if it's not successful, you can still use your website for the blog network, your own blog network you're building. So smart. Yeah. Okay, great. So I'm uh, so I'm kind of flipping through, the, and, and uh, I, I don't really particularly have these. Uh, organized. So we've got cross-channel mojo, a little bit of search engine domination here. Uh, you, you have written here with a big smiley face, this is how we do it. You rank number one, number two, and number three. Um, and in this case, what you did was you actually ranked three different websites, it looks like. No? Is it two? No, no you no, did. No. Three, three, three different, different websites. Domains. Yes, three different websites. How did you do on this one? I'm not sure because it's, it's from last year. Um, Actually, this one wasn't th th that successful. I don't know why. Um, we just didn't make that much. Yeah. Uh, I can't recall how much was it, but I remember that it was not that successful. Uh, do, do you? Uh, so generally, uh, do you do you do one site? Uh, uh, when when do you decide to do multiple sites? Uh, when we got, when I got the sense that uh, I can rank. Uh, multiple sites on the first page of Google, or maybe first pre-positioned, I actually started uh, setting up uh, multiple websites for each launch. So, so you uh, do it for every launch? Uh, what was that? So do you do that for every launch? Yeah, yeah. Uh, three domains usually. That's really cool. Uh, so for non-stop traffic formula, how did that one go? Um, this one is also from last year, I think. A uh, couple of thousand, I guess. Nice. And is this site, the, the nonstop traffic formula.org, is that you? Um, let me see which. No, our site is actually second. Nonstop traffic formula site.org. Yeah. Okay, great. I'll try to zoom in so people can see that. Nonstop traffic formula site.org. All right, great. So here we have um, affiliate uh, affiliate contest app dev secrets. Uh, so you were actually number two in this affiliate contest. Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. It's, Fifty-four uh, sales. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, you must have killed it on that. How much? How much did you make on that launch? Um, there was actually a site. It was a lead site of mine. Uh, that I think I have rankings later on. It was on how to make an app. Uh, yeah, it was how to make an, uh, make an app, and mm -hmm. I actually ranked on how to make an app and how to make an iPhone app. Oh my God! And I was monetizing it with, with this offer. 
with uh, app Devil Seekers, it was actually a course how to do your uh, iPhone app and how to monetize it. That's great. That's really cool that you did so, that. So, yeah. so, so you're really getting into like transitioning into into just serious affiliate marketing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, we have a little, little bit of hot dogging going on here. While on vacation in the Canary Islands, uh, $894 in ClickBank. That's no chump change. 